Hi Krishna Vani, could you please introduce about yourself? Yes, sir. Uh, good morning, sir. First Speak loud. First of all, thank you for giving me this opportunity to introduce myself. My name is Krishna Vani. I'm from, uh, basically from Surya Pet, but currently staying in Hyderabad. I did my graduation in BSc Computer from Mahatma Gandhi University with aggregate 86 per, 86 percentage uh, from Mahatma Gandhi University. And um, my, self, uh, my hobby, hobby, sorry. And um, my long term goal is to get a job in a reputed company. Mm -hmm. My short term goal is to good position. Mm -hmm. And my hobbies are uh, self motivated and speak loud. My hobbies, Talk confidently. My hobbies are uh, cooking and listening music. My skills are uh, manual testing and automation testing mm -hmm. for Java. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you, sir. Okay, good. Who is your role model, Krishna Vani? My role model was my mother. Could you please explain her? Yes, sir. Uh, my mother, because uh, she, uh, she, the communication is very good. Okay, speak loud and talk confidently. Okay. okay. Whatever it may be, you can talk. Okay, sir. Okay. What do you know about the SDLC? Yes, sir. SDLC software. Uh, it speak is a, loud. It is a step by step process and uh, software development life. Uh, it stands for software development life cycle. There are uh, seven phases requirement collection, feasibility study, design, coding, installation, maintenance. Uh, these are uh, requirement collection. In this phase, the uh, business analysis goes to the business analysis. Uh, sit there face, face to face. And uh, uh, that's it. And the requirement collection. Uh, high level. Uh, in this phase, the high level team sit together and uh, discuss about the uh, profitable or not. And the HR team is uh, 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 HR team is is there. And next to finance team and uh, uh, okay, next to design. Design means blueprint of the application. Uh, there are two types: uh, high level and low level. Uh, low le high level. It is known as uh, component level. This, uh, it is done by the architecture and uh, low level it is uh, it is uh, is known as a uh, component level mm -hmm. uh, it is done by architecture mm -hmm. uh, next uh, high level it is done by uh, module level uh, and in module level it is done by uh, manager mm -hmm. and uh, coding mm -hmm. coding uh, it is uh, uh, okay cool who will do smoke testing who will do smoke testing, Krishna Vani? Smoke testing. Who will do smoke testing? Who will do? Who, who, who will? Who will, who will uh, testing? Engineering. Who will do the unit testing? Uh, testing. Uh, unit test engineer. Unit test engineer. No, test engineer. Are you sure about the unit testing? Yes, sir. So, how many types of environments do we have? Uh, three, sir. Could you please explain about that? Unit test uh, program. Uh, uh, unit test program, domain expert and... Uh, no, no, I'm, what I'm asking, please listen carefully. How many types of environments do we have? Do you know about the environments or not? Yes, sir. Tell me. Spiral model. Okay. No, that is the model. I'm asking the environmental. Tester, yes. where the tester will test uh, testing? Okay, cool. What is the difference between black box testing and white box testing? Don't feel panic, okay? Feel free to talk, okay? okay. Hmm. What is the difference between the black box testing and white box testing? Black box testing. Uh, black box testing, it is done by the uh, testing test engineer. Okay. Uh, white box testing is done by the developer. Very good. Uh, black box testing, it, uh, line by line uh, execute. Mm -hmm. uh, Black box testing, mm -hmm. white box testing. Uh, I use a uh, test engineer uh, uh, ready the one application. Mm -hmm. Use the application like user to identify the number of defects. Okay. And uh, uh, black box testing, fun uh, black box testing, functional testing, integration testing, mm -hmm. uh, system testing are there. Mm -hmm. And uh, white box testing, uh, loop path, mm -hmm. response and memory mm -hmm. is there. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay, cool. So, what is the RTM, Krishnamani? 
RTM means uh, uh, requirement traceability matrix. Okay. It is a document. Okay. Uh, it is a document. Uh, How the document is helped to the testers? Helped to the testers. Um, three individual uh, test test lead are there. Test lead uh, three individual came to single uh, requirement uh, test case. So mm -hmm. that's why it is. Okay. Cool. So, what is the drawbacks of waterfall model? Drawbacks of um, waterfall model, life critical and mission critical. Life critical and mission critical. What is the meaning about that? Life critical and mission critical. Uh, for example, life critical health uh, hospital. Okay. Uh, mission critical means, for example, um, officers is it uh, like uh, Indian Army. Okay. Indian Army is a whole related to the waterfall model. A uh, mission critical, right? So tell me about the mission critical. Where did you learn the, the testing? Sir, it is a fair and constant job. Where did you learn the testing? Where you are trained? Chief Spider Punjab Okay, good. So what is the meaning of uh, Regression testing and integration testing. Regression testing and integration. Whenever developer does support this across the build due to the human constant or uh, impacted area is known as a regression testing and integration testing. Integration testing a data flow between the rela relation between the data flow is known as integration testing. Who is our Telangana CM? KCR sir. What is the full form of KCR? Salvapamsa Chandra Shekhar Rao. Who is our uh, Andhra Pradesh CM? Jagan Mohan Red. Okay. Like, uh, what's your hobbies? Like, uh, cooking and. Uh, which type of cooking you are making? Curry, sir. Curry, sir. What is your favorite curry? My favorite curry. Chicken or mutton? Second, good. So, like, how did you write the test cases in the Excel? Which name that you are using, Krishna? Sir? How did you write the test cases? Which test cases? How to write the test cases in the Excel? Which template you are going to use? Expected result we writing, sir. Okay. Uh, we go for Excel. Uh, Speak loud. Speak loud. Maintain confidence. At the time only, interview your appearance on your profile. Yes, okay. Whatever you are telling something it is wrong or right, please. Tell confident. Tell in confident, okay? Hmm. Sir, uh, we write the expected uh, expected result. Uh, for example, uh, login, uh, amount, uh, application or uh, amount transfer, uh, modular login, mm -hmm. uh, requirement, uh, and uh, next uh, expected result, actual result. Mm -hmm. uh, these are writing. Okay. What is the difference between the constructor and constructor overloading? Constructor and constructor overloading. Uh, declaring multiple number of uh, methods. Uh, declaring Speak loud. Tell confident. Okay, sir. Declaring multiple number of constructor uh, with a different number of parameter, type of parameter, order of parameter is called as constructor. Uh, constructor overloading or um, declaring multiple uh, number of uh, constructor, uh, different number of parameter, order of parameter, type of parameter is called as constructor overloading. Uh, constructor uh, don't have any return type uh, as well as uh, a constructor static and it depends on static uh, nothing but uh, static and non-static what is the wrapper classes wrapper classes wrapper classes represents the uh, it is a uh, primitive type uh, whereas boxing or unboxing uh, it is uh, it is a process of uh, it is a process of represent a uh, uh, primitive type data to wrapper class object and unboxing is a it is a process of wrapper class object to uh, re, uh, represent it. Okay, multiple inheritance are uh, allowed in the Java or not? Multiple? Inheritance. Yes, sir, allowed. Are you sure? Yes, sir. How many types of inheritance do we have? Yes, sir, four types. Could you please explain about that? Single level, uh, single level and multi-level and multiple and hierarchical. A single level, uh, it is 
it is a one i'm asking only types yes sir okay multiple inheritance are allowed in the java or not yes sir allowed sir okay good so what is the difference between method and class method and class uh, method is a member uh, which uh, method is a member uh, it allows uh, it is a it, uh, we write the java logics business logics and the class is the uh, we write a main uh, main class and the class is the uh, within uh, the uh, okay yeah. cool uh, how many types of locators do we have krishna many yes, sir eight types uh, could you please explain about that yes, sir id uh, locators are identified the uh, element inside the html code mm -hmm. uh, locators are eight types uh, id name class name uh, link test partial link test mm -hmm. and x path uh, css selector tag name mm -hmm. What is the difference between the text ng and the text unit framework? Text ng and text unit framework. Framework. Yeah. Okay, so text ng. Text ng control the execution flow of our framework in uh, automation. Text ng stands for testing next generation. Um, uh, uh, put, uh, to perform working to programming language, J unit and N unit. Um, um, Test ng execution flow of our framework. Uh, we have many advantages. Um, uh, test ng execution uh, reports our test cases. Um, test test ng uh, perform uh, batch execution, parallel execution, cross source execution, and test ng uh, perform uh, test ng execution flow and um, uh, data parameterization and the data provider. Okay, cool. So, how much rating you are giving in the manual testing? Out of ten. Eight, sir. Eight. Okay. And code Java. Eight, sir. Eight. And automation. Nine, sir. So, what do you know about the POM class? Yes, sir. POM class. Uh, POM stands. Um, POM stands for POM object model. It is design pattern of Java, which is mainly used to store the, uh, which is mainly used to store the Java in one main class. Uh, it is a, uh, another name is a, a POM class, um, page object repository and element repository. Mm -hmm. um, POM class we are using init elements method, and POM class we are using at the rate find by and at the rate find by. Mm -hmm. uh, these are rules are um, a number of pages equal to number of classes. Uh, instead of that. Uh, um, palm class are we are we are not using uh, find element and find elements instead of that we are using at the rate find by and at the rate find by and the rate find by all okay cool so like uh, what is your drawback drawback uh, what is your uh, advantage what you have, what your strength and data, weakness? Uh, data secure and the maintenance, init elements are we using? No, 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 I'm asking what is your strength and weakness? My strength are, okay, sir, my strength are uh, self noted and organized, uh, key clearness. Okay, see Krishna Vani, uh, as my observation, okay, yes. so uh, before you are telling the answer, first you should try to understand the question. Okay. I think you have some communication gap, right? Yes, sir. Communication issue, no problem with that. Please try. Try and try. Definitely will get the success. Yes, sir. Definitely will get a job. Okay. But before, whenever you are telling something, please listen the question. This because of I'm observing, I'm asking some questions. You are telling something answers. Yes, sir. Okay. You are mentioning some keywords. You are you are resume, right? Yes, sir. Okay. So whatever I'm asking, if I'm asking some question, you are telling like a magaf style. Okay. Okay, uh, TM is uh, defined as a, you are telling like this, but in the real time, don't use this word. Okay. Tell in practical. Yes, and uh, third thing is, please maintain confident. Okay. Whatever you are telling, please tell with the confidence. Okay. At the time only, you will get the job because of nowadays, competition is very high. Very high. You have the good technical stuff. Yes, you have some knowledge about that. But whenever you are telling something, please maintain these three tips. Okay. okay? okay. Do you have any queries now? Yes, sir. Yeah, tell me. What do you have the queries? Do you have any queries? No. Yes, sir? No. No, sir. Do you have any questions? No, sir. Okay. Thank you. All the best. We will get back to you soon.